In this step-by-step -step drawing tutorial, we're going to take a look at how to draw a rose. For a more detailed breakdown of this process, including still images that you can follow along with, be sure to visit howtodrawstuff.com. You can follow the link in the description below. Drawing a rose can be a little bit tricky. It's a flower, and a flower is made up of organic shapes. Organic shapes are also called freeform shapes. So you're going to begin the drawing by drawing a slightly curved line for the stem of the rose. Bring two slightly curved lines up of either side of the rows. Now draw two lines that are also slightly curved towards the center of the flower. Allow one of the lines to go underneath the other line. Draw a few more curved lines like the one in the picture towards the top of the rows. Also draw a couple of organic shapes like the one shown here underneath the first two lines that you drew. You can also add a shape and a line for one of the rose petals shooting off the stem. Now draw more slightly curved lines like the one in the picture. Each one of these curved lines will be the top of the rose petals. You can also add another petal with another line and a shape on the other side of the stem. Hopefully at this stage you can begin to see the rose. Draw lines downward from the curved lines that you have drawn in the previous steps. These lines are the edges of the rose petals. You can also add more petals as you wish. Roses are pretty complex flowers so the more petals that you add the more realistic your rose will look. Don't overdo it. Now you have enough information in your drawing to finish the rose. Make sure that you include a variety of line weights and thicknesses. You may also want to add some shading to indicate the form of the flower. You can also add texture by drawing cross contour lines across the petals of the rose. So there you go, that's how to draw a rose. Now go give it to someone that you care about. And don't forget to visit howtodrawstuff.com.